Hi, welcome to introduction to probability. This is video lecture number five. And in this lecture, we are going to discuss about probability of cards. That's probability of playing cards. The concept of probability of playing cards is very important competitive exam because it comes normally in competitive exams. So we are going to the concept. So playing cards, as we all know, it is a pack. It is also called a deck which contains 52 cards which means that a pack of playing cards will contain 52 cards the 52 cards are divided into four suits it's four different groups we co normally call it a suit which means that 52 cards in four suits which means that one suit will contain 13 cards each suit having uh, having separate name and separate simple what are this the first suit this one that is called spade okay it is looking like a tree and it is called spade it is 13 in numbers so spade is in black color always the second one is with a heart simple it is called heart so it is also in 13 number it is always in red color the next one is that diamond diamond is also in red color and it looks like a diamond and the total number of diamond cards is 13 the fourth one and the last one is called club okay it is also in 13 in number so what we can conclude for 52 cards four suits 13 cards in each in each suit so there are a total 26 black cards and 26 red cards okay so now we are going in detail into suit so suit this is the spade suit there are 13 cards i will explain in detail about each suit so there are 13 cards in each suit so you can see there is one a then two three four five six seven eight nine ten then j q and k okay similarly and the simple in spade suit is the sp spade simple below the letter there is a spade simple okay so next suit is the heart suit it is looking the same but the only difference is the instead of spade symbol it is having the heart symbol next is diamond one it is same looking same but the difference is that it is having the diamond instead of spade and heart the last one is club suit okay now i am going to explain in detail about each suit okay you must understand that each suits are identical which means that if you know about spade suit it, it is applicable to hard suit also okay so this is spade suit so you can see there are 13 cards F 5 in the first row second row 5 then last row 3 so the first one that is it is written as a that is called ace okay in each suit there will be one ace and next nine cards are numbered from 2 to 10 that is 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 okay these are number cards so how many number cards are there in each suit there are nine number cards numbered from 2 to 10 okay one is not there okay next three cards are j q and k j is called jack okay J it is a face card which means that there is some face in that card so it is called a face card jack jack then next is q that is q in q in is also a face card then third one is k king okay so in each suit there will be nine numbered cards numbered from two to nine two to ten and one ace card and three face cards okay i hope you understand what is mean by a deck of cards that is 52 numbers then we cut divided that deck of cards into four suits that is uh, spade heart then diamond and club so each suit is having 13 number of cards 13 number of cards means 10 9 numbered cards one ace and three face cards that is jack 
Kuhn and King. Okay, so now we are going to conclude. So there are total 52 number of cards, then total number of red cards that is 26, and total number of black cards is 26. How 26 came? Because all the hard cards and uh, diamond cards they are in twin red color 13 plus 13 that's 26 number of black cards it is total um, spare card plus total number of that uh, club card so it is 26 then number of spades is 13 number of hearts is 13 number of diamonds is 13 and number of clubs is 13 okay so each suit contains one king card, queen, ace and jack. Okay, each suit contains. So there will be four king, four queen, four ace and four jack. Okay, red kings two. How? Because in hard suit and diamond suit the kings will be in red color. So red kings are two. Black kings two. Total four kings same for q and ace and jack also then number of face cards in each suit is 3 so total number of face cards is 4 into 3 that's 12 means each suit 3 total number of suits is 4 so total number 12 so here is a question for you a card is drawn from a well shuffled pack of 52 cards what is the probability of getting a king of red color I hope you can answer this question. It is a simple basic equation of probability number of chance of getting a king of red color divided by total number of chances. If you can solve this problem, you can solve it and comment your answer on the comment box. Anyway, I'm going to explain the problems of card probability of cards in coming lectures in detail for e easy understanding of you. So thank you for watching. You can watch lecture number six. That is the coming lecture. And thank you for watching. Thank you.